I'm standing here with uh, Nelson Mbele going for the Gauteng middleweight title against uh, Don John van Heerden. How's the confidence levels going into this one? I'm 100% confident for this fight. I've been preparing for weeks and weeks and weeks, so I'm ready. And of course, Nelson, you know, middleweight division, you've been there your whole career. You know, Don John's been lower, he's been higher, and he's coming, you know, settling. Um, do you think this will be the highest, uh, the biggest challenge of your career, I should rather say? Yeah, definitely. You know, I'm fighting for Gauteng title, I'm fighting a good opponent. It's going to be one of my best fights, so I'm ready for it. What's some of the new things you've worked on coming into this fight? Obviously, he is a southpaw, so that would have been the first challenge you would have had to go through in training camp. Yeah, there's a lot I've been working on, Hayden. Um, I've been even training, sparring in different gyms now. I've been sparring in the Brian Mitchell gym. The guys there have been helping me out. I've been sparring in different gyms and it's been helping me a whole lot. So I don't see myself struggling against him today. Been getting any work in with uh, Rock Knapp? Obviously, that's one of your former teammates as well. I've worked with him previously, but not any not not any time soon from now for this for this training camp. No, but um, Pigelani has been helping me out a lot. He's also a good southpaw, so I've been having good training. Yeah. And of course, you and uh, Terence, as, as I call him, it, uh, we're actually you know at one stage like almost like mini rivals, but now I see you guys are helping each other out. No, Terence is a good brother of mine now. Yeah, he's been helping. He helped me out once for sparring, and I'm very appreciative of that. And you know, it's just a good oak, and I appreciate him as well. And of course, uh, another, uh, you've worked with Joyce before, if I'm not mistaken, on one of her previous tournaments. Um, working with TLB Promotions, how do you feel? No, I feel very happy. You know, I'm grateful for the opportunity to fight for the Gauteng title, and I'm grateful to TLB Promotions for that opportunity. Thank you to Mama Joyce for that. I want to get your comments. I did an interview with Donjon van Heerden as well. He says, if he doesn't care, you owe you, he'll outbox you. What's your response to that? He's a boxer. He's going to think like that. So... No problem. All I can say is we'll see tomorrow what happens. And I'm confident that I'll win the fight. I want to get your thoughts on the Gauteng title as well. What's your, what's your thoughts on the belt itself? Belt is a belt, Mr. Hayden. It's a big achievement. The moment you win a belt is an achievement. So I'm very, very prepared for this fight. I was on weight a week before. I was very dedicated. I dedicated myself. Pre-med, I was already on weight. So that just says to you that I'm prepared for this fight and I'm ready. Yeah, on that note as well, you do look in the best shape of your career when I saw you get on the scale, so congratulations uh, for your preparations. Another good statistic, the Gauteng middleweight title, it hasn't been on the line since 2017, so a little piece of history uh, to bring it back. Yeah, I am very, very honored to be participating for the Gauteng title after so long. The middleweight Gauteng title, I would be very honored and I'm ready to take that title. Of course, so you got to have, I know you have your, your eyes fully set on Don John, but you also got to have eyes on how the middleweight division is playing out. Yeah, for sure. Um, the middleweight division, it's, I'm, I'm very, very, very close, watching it closely. And, um, you know, the winner of this fight is going to get an SA title shot. You know, if I win the fight, I'm taking that second spot. I'm challenging for the SA title. You know, so it's also a good, it's also a good um, thing for me. That's one of my motivations to win this fight as well. You know, it's going to boost me in the ratings as well. So it's very important that I win the fight. Obviously, you fully focus on the fights, but also in the background, you know, um, Don John van Heeren also been trained by Didi Tolo as well, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, um, according to what I know, he's been training at, his, at the McAuslin gym now. So that's all I know for now. I don't know whether he's been training at the Brian Mitchell, but I've never seen him there ever since I've been training there for sparring. Yeah. And of course, we're with old time coach, uh, as, as per usual, um, still getting in that good work with coach. Yeah, no. Mimo Spirito has been pushing me big time. Mimo, Shannon, all the guys in the gym, they've been helping me. I'm very grateful for the work. You know, Hayden, I feel like I'm going to shock a lot of people in this fight, including yourself. And I'm not going to say much. I just want to show you guys what I'm capable of doing tomorrow. You've got 10 rounds to do the business, a lot of rounds. Um, so even if you are a slow starter, you can make your way back in the fight. Are, are you anticipating it to go the distance? I'm prepared for anything. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm fit for all the rounds. But if the, the, the KO is there, I'm taking it. You know, I can definitely knock him out. If the KO is there, I'll take it. But I'm fit for all the rounds. If you could give uh, Don John a message before you step in the ring with him. Hope you're ready, my brother, and all the best for tomorrow. Let's give the fans a show.
All right, Nelson, and then lastly, Javani. Thank you. Is any shout outs for anybody? Uh, thank you to you, Hayden, as always. You know, let's start off with you. Thank you for the interview. Uh, thank you to my, tra my trainers, Shannon, Mimos, Perito, Johnny, all the guys in the gym that have been helping me. I'm very grateful for that. Thank you to my family and friends, my girlfriend, my mother, my father, everyone that has been supporting me in this upcoming um, fight. I've been training very hard for this one and come tomorrow night it's gonna be a hell of a fight.